Hi, I'm Pete Anderson, Director of Sales for Leader Instruments, the test equipment people. We are focusing this NAB 2016 on some of our 4K products that we have. We've been selling 4K products now for the last few years, but we've continued to add new features and new functions to these units to make them more relevant depending on the needs of customers. So right here in our booth, we happen to be showing our LV5490, which is, happens to be our 4K waveform monitor. Again, we've been selling for a few years. We've added certain features to that, such as a CI display, so that the customer is able to check and verify that the content falls within 709, or now 2020 color space. We've also added HDR monitoring, because HDR has become very important these days. In regards to HDR, We've added not only a waveform display that shows you NIT levels, but also at the same time, we've also added what's called our Cinezone display, which traditionally has been used to indicate luminance values on the picture by using false colors. Now we've gone a step further on HDR, and what we've done is we've indicated on the picture display using false colors the actual NIT levels, so that you're able to see what part of the picture actually falls within HDR, and what part actually falls as simply standard dynamic range or SDR. So we've also added some other features that we're showing in our booth and that happens to be a car that can be placed in the 5490 that allows for operation in 12G. That card happens to have four 12G inputs on it and is also backward compatible so you can also look at 3G, HD and SD. Along with that, we're also showing a new IP card for the unit, which allows for the ability to look at video over IP. Right now, we're supporting the Sony protocol, which is the Network Media Interface protocol, but we'll be adding other companies to that as necessary. So you have a unit that has the ability to not only look at 3G in one form, or HD or SD, but now also 12G, and also IP on the same unit.